Okay, I'll be right back. Um, so just give me a couple of minutes. We'll uh, get swapped over to something else. We'll do some more streaming. So just give me a minute. Let's swap screens over to that one. And we'll figure out what to play. Um, let me bring up... We'll bring up this, but also if you've got a Warboats idea or want to see something Warboat-wise, let me know. I'll be right back, though. Oh, okay. So, let's see. That was fun. Good little practice run with some other peeps. So, yeah, uh, I don't know if anybody was watching the restream, but uh, we were third place overall. Um, first place was a 133.20. Second place was a 135.21. We 
we were third with a 136.11. So not too terribly far behind. Um, and a decent run overall. Like, I'm, I'm happy with it. To be perfectly honest. Um, some stuff could have gone better in there. Um, some of the execution for some of those bosses was not where I'd like it to be. Because um, we've been playing better than that. Usually. But... You know, not a not a bad run, um, and definitely some good um, effort in there to kind of get a, a practice in and see how the mode's going and really face off against some good opponents. Um, first and second are definitely uh, really good. Even the others who were in this one were all quite good racers. So um, I am really pleased with, you know, finishing third overall out of the eight of us so i'll probably watch it back see what i think about it in the moment with some hindsight as well but you know i'm not in any rush to say better or worse on some regards so um so let's find something to play though wasn't sure how long that seed was going to take and it definitely was quicker than uh you sometimes think those will go <laughs> and we don't have an achievement yet for today. <laughs> we need to get one of those. <laughs> the important stuff. Playing Zelda is secondary usually. To the uh, the achievement hunting. Now I got the TEA post that apparently all the achievements on this one are now had their flags changed so am I completely screwed on this game now game is dead Darn, that means we're not going to be able to black out the board. Does that mean I'm not going to be able to sink all the boats? Is the question. C4. Uh, yeah, we might not be able to black out the board now, or at least sink all the ships, I mean. It says it's discontinued. For the achievement I would need. I mean, I can see what happens if we try to load it. Oh, apparently I own it as a disc. Okay, never mind. We don't have to check right now. Although, you know what? Let's grab the disc and let's see.
So according to Olcash, this is going to fail completely. It's going to fail gloriously when I try to load this up. I'll believe it, but worth a shot. Yep. Nope. No doing. <laughs> no surprise. It's dead, Jim. <laughs> yep. So let's delete it. <laughs> I gained a coaster? Wow. A whole coaster. Project Starship. Could b go through Butterfly. How long would Butterfly take, you think? Ten seconds? Okay, let's see what we can do. Just a minute, though. I don't show... I don't show myself making purchases. I don't need people seeing my, any of my account info. You don't need to see if I have what credit card I might be using or what funds I have available in that account. Right? Nobody needs to know that. That's me, myself, and I need to know that. I don't mind that one as much. Like, it's not a huge deal to me.
Yeah, but that's so easy to, like, find. To be honest, like... It's not like I am a hard person to reach. What are the achievements? Just for completing the levels? Yeah, for ten, completing 10 levels. I don't know if I use 10, but definitely two. So, Ima, is this month going to be... Is So, you said this is an Xbox month again for you. Now, when you say it's an Xbox month, is that gamer score? Or is it just Xbox games? Like. I mean, there's plenty of other gamer score you could get. Wee! We're going through a pipe. It was funny. Like, if you look at the day that this one came out, um, that same day saw... Uh, a game come out from Rat and East Asia as well, who are also usually your very, very quick ones. Rattalaka is not always the quickest, like super, super fast, but... Um, East Asia is. Yeah, Skylanders is probably something I should go finish a bunch of those. I finished the first two. I finished the, like, Skylanders Spyro's Adventure type thing or whatever they called it. Um, but then I never really completed the other stuff. Uh, I did that one in Giants. I have a lot of them as well, Ima, so I, I know. <laughs> Sitting on a gold mine? How so? Inform me, because I have probably a collection that rivals yours then. They can't be worth that much, can they?
Really? Opened, it sells for that much. Crazy. Uh, any particular, like, series of them? Out of curiosity? Huh. Interesting. I don't know if I, I, I don't, I didn't ever pay attention to any, if, if any of them were actually that rare, so I'd be surprised. sad i mean i think part of it is you know self-inflicted in the sense that like they just put too many out but it was actually a decent series of games i think that's the completion Yeah, I think that's that's the issue. Like they there were just too many. You know, at a certain point it just gets to be too many games, too many plastic toys. And then you combine it with the fact that like Lego Dimensions and uh, Disney Infinity were out there. There was just so many. So it was, I think it was a bit overwhelming to kind of expect the bubble to keep going. digital version of Starlink. Um, by the time Starlink came out, I was kind of done with the I want to own these plastic things so much as I liked the idea of the game. Like, I think the Switch version kind of interested me just from, like, the standpoint of, hey, I could have an, uh, <laughs> you know, I could have Star Fox. And, like, for the Skylanders, there was, like, you could have uh, Donkey Kong, right? 
So, like, there were some neat ones in the collection. Yeah, I didn't buy the Switch ones. Olkesh, did you buy the R-Wing? Oh, neat. It was a Starlink vehicle. Uh, it's Fox McClouds from Star Fox. Well, it was only on the Switch version of Starlink. I'm a... Are you going to come back to me? Or are you gone forever? I actually have a funny story about how I originally started playing the Skylanders games. Okay, you can't cheese the level because it's just too slow to cheese it. Um... So, when Swap Force came out, so I think Swap Force was the third one. Um, when Swap Force came out, um, the first two, the original and Giants, were really cheap. Um... So I had picked up, um, I decided to pick up the, um, I decided I was going to pick up the first one because it was like, it was like 10 bucks or less. And I was just like, you know, let's see if I even enjoy the game and we'll go from there. So, pick up the game, and a couple weeks later, or I go to pick it up from Best Buy, and I go to the pickup window, and what is awaiting me but a copy of Swap Force? And I'm like, well, that's well, well and good. It's the brand new game, and I could be getting it for like well, well, well below the actual cost of the game, I'll be honest and tell them that, no, you're trying to give me the wrong game. So, I get, you know, they swap it out, and I get the one that I ordered. Um, and then, uh, then 
I do the same for Giants a, a little while after that. Um, cause Giants was super on sale. And they do it again. They've got, you know, I go pick it up and instead of Giants, they've got Swap Force again for me. And again, I'm like, wrong copy. Um, yeah. So I, I'm like, no, no, no. This, this is not the one that I ordered. So I get Giants. Finally, <laughs> I do get Swap Force though. <laughs> Just like, yeah, no, I, I, I'll get that this time. I'd love to say, like, that time they didn't give it to me, and they gave me some other version, but no, they did give me Swap Force on the third try. So what, do we have to kill all the enemies? To get rid of the exclamation point boxes? What is the rules? Yep, okay. Yeah, I, I did enjoy um, some of, like, the special versions of stuff. Because um, I did buy quite a few of the, like, the dark ones. Like, I bought Crash, um, Sensei for, like, the, what, the Imaginators, was it?
so I have quite a collection between all the different versions. I don't have all of them. I couldn't go that far ever. My main goal was usually to have like one of each element each vehicle type from each generation, like... You know, stuff like that. Yeah, there were so many, so I could see that working for sure. I would just look for good sales on them. <laughs> You know, there's a ladder race in 20 minutes. It's a cross keys. I don't know if my collection was that bad. Actually, I don't want all of the bees dead, do I? Because if all of them are dead, I'm kind of... Well, I'm screwed anyway. <laughs> hey, Lord Alucard.
No, I'm, I'm just thinking, like, there's a cross keys, and I don't get to race a lot of cross keys ladder just because it's, like, always at the worst times for me. So it is very tempting to get into the cross key ladder race today. I wonder if I did this wrong. Yeah, I did. Eh, not much. How are you doing today? I don't want to do that. Let's see if we can recover from that mistake. You know, those are sometimes the best days to have. Honestly, not a bad thing. fair. I just think, you know, sometimes you need that kind of day. Everybody does. You know what? I want to cross keys. I do. I want to. Let's see how many people are signed up for it. Yeah, let's go for it. No, no. How do you solve this one? I'm not that special. I can get over to that. But how would I get back from either of them?
Oh, wait. You have to do that for one of them. For sure. Okay, so you can't land actually to it. That's what it is. No, no. It's all good. Makes sense. I rushed that one. <sighs> Not like me doing these levels matters. I'm sure I'll have to redo them when they do the inevitable title update. Wouldn't be the first time a Zatillion game I've had to go back to. Yeah, no jumping. A non-jumping platformer. It's not a terrible idea. I've definitely played worse games. Many worse. People giving themselves the weirdest names. For ladder. Okay, let's get out of this game. We can finish the achievement list, but we're gonna add it to the group. Because wouldn't be surprised if that one does get a gamer score update in the future and we have to complete more of it. Because that is the Zatillion published games way. Okay, let's swap it over. Um, emulator, performance mode, yeah, we played a little bit more of it the other day. Um, which MSU do I want to use today? Let's rock out a bit. 
It just doesn't. It's not a bad game. It just doesn't grab you immediately. 